What is up guys, Stark here. Today I'm going to be taking a look at the 30 Stamina, Chaos, Difficulty, Apu, Colosseum stage. And for this we are going to be using a double Stronghold Ace team, which is our trusty go-to team to clear most, if not all, of the Colosseums. I'm sure there's some he can't beat, but he can clear most of them, so we're going to just keep using it. And for this team, you know, it's your pretty standard Stronghold Ace team. We are using Gladius here. You, If you don't have Gladius, you can swap him out for the Fortnite Wapple. But I actually don't have my Fortnite Wapple maxed. I don't even have him evolved, actually. So I can't use him. So I'm going to use Gladius instead. Now, it works pretty much the same. And I'll explain both strategies as we go through the Colosseum. Alright, so here we go. You know, typical stages 1 to 3, just gonna go ahead and install for your specials. Because you will be needing them on stage 4. Because that's like the hardest part of the, the Colosseum, and that's usually the case with most Colosseums, is the stage 4 mini boss is usually harder than the actual boss itself. And in this one, we have Lauji, who is actually really tricky, so you do have to be careful for him. But, you know, if you have the right team, he's not an issue. Here we go, we're just going to stall a little bit here. As usual in these videos, I do stall more than I actually need to, just to kind of show you guys. You could do it if you don't have max specials. So here we go, we're just going to... Let that blue guy chain us there, and we'll get an extra turn out of this. And there we go, moving on to stage 3, which is going to be our turtle stage. Oh, she's gonna heal. Yeah, you want to make sure you don't do that. You don't want to accidentally auto-target the turtle and lose a couple turns there. But our specials are good. We could go into the next room right now if we really wanted to, but we don't want to. I'm just going to play it out normally. Now you don't need... <clears throat> well, well, never mind. You don't need to uh, stall for orbs or anything like that because Lao G is going to swap all of your orbs into G orbs as soon as you enter the room. And then he'll throw up a delay protector. So you can't like Usopp him or anything like that. But basically what you want to do here is you just want to keep attacking Lao G until you get him right above 50% HP. You do not want to get him under 50% at all. Now you will have to take one or two hits from him in order to do this, but... It is better than losing. See, as you can see there, he attacks for 8800, which is kind of a lot, but when we're using Stronghold Ace teams, it really doesn't make that much of a difference. We are going to grab that meat orb there, though. Now, what I could do here, I could drop him under 50% HP on this turn, but I'm not going to. I'm not going to use my specials. What I'm going to do is I'm just going to take that second hit and get him as close as possible to 50%, so we have two turns to work with on the second turn. There we go. I'm going to stop right there. That should be perfect. Okay, so now this is where things get a little bit different for me. Since I'm using Gladius, my strategy changes slightly. So, if you were using Wapple in this situation, you're going to go ahead and use Heracles here. Let me just do this real fast. I don't want to mess it up. Okay, so use Heracles here. And then, 
you, if you're using Wapple, you use Wapple here to lock your orbs. But since I don't have Wapple, I'm using Ace to do that. And then I use Gladius to do that extra HP cut. And then I'm going to kill Lao Ji on this turn so I can preserve my orbs for the following turn. If you're using Wapple, you can go ahead and get away with not killing Lao Ji on the first turn. But we have to because we cannot use that second ace of special. We need to save that for Apu himself. And so there we go. We killed Lao Ji and we're moving on to Apu. So he's going to start by summoning a bunch of fodder units. And this is why you need ace. So you can use ace of special here to eliminate the fodder units. And then you're going to kill Apu really easily when you use Frankie and Zephyr special. There you go guys, you have two turns to kill him here. Let me just let him use a special here. I think he just berserks himself. It's not an issue if he's by himself, but if none of those father units are there, then you're probably going to lose. So you definitely want to make sure you have that ace of special ready to, to knock out those units. And that's why Wapple is really good for this Coliseum stage, because you can just get that extra turn of locked orbs. But Gladius does work. It is a little bit trickier but if you hit your perfects you'll be fine but there you go guys that is coliseum of who 30 stamina i hope you guys enjoyed the video and if you did feel free to like comment and subscribe and i will see you guys next time